When I was seven years old, I had an arteriovenous malformation rupture, which caused me to lose all feeling and control in my right side. Within a few months, I gained it back, but it was inoperable, so they did radiation on it, and I suffered from radiation injury about a year later. Losing my right hand and my right foot at first, it was really hard adapting. Anything bilateral was difficult for me. It was harder to like do everyday things like brushing my teeth, opening a Ziploc or opening a container was hard. I've tried many therapies uh, in the past 10 years. With a lot of the therapies like hyperbaric oxygen treatment, uh, CIMT, uh, Bioness, Easton, basically anything, I would gain, I would see improvement, but then a few weeks after like I stopped doing it, uh, my hand would go back to being tight again. So I was basically starting over. The Ipsy hand has a tablet, a handpiece, and a headset. When I imagine my fingers moving, the Ipsy hand senses it and moves it for me. By doing this every day, it helps reconnect my hand to the healthy part of my brain. I've been using the Epsi hand for about seven months, and I use it about five to seven times a week for 30 minutes or so. And I started seeing results probably like three weeks after I started, and it was just uh, the pinch and a few months into it, I was able to wiggle my thumb. I've done it basically every day, but there are times where I take a week of a break and I still have not lost that improvement. Opening a door or the fridge or the microwave, like if I need it, my hand will do it. I've loved to run since middle school and my arm is normally like tight and like it has tone and it's hard to move. But recently when I've been running, it's felt more natural and I'm not like focused on it. Because I've seen so much improvement in, the, in so little time, I'm hopeful that it will give me a lot more movement and function. When I meet someone and I'm greeting them, uh, they often reach out the right hand to shake mine. And that's been really difficult because when I first meet someone, my hand's clenched up and then they're like, they have all these questions uh, for me about what happened. I'm really excited to like, if that can open up so I can shake someone's hand without having to explain myself. <laughs>